Welcome to County Office, your ultimate guide to local government services and public records. Let's get started. Are there any voting restrictions in Squeal Kill, Pennsylvania? Voting is a fundamental right in the United States, pivotal for the functioning of its democracy. In Squeal Kill, Pennsylvania, as in the rest of the country, this right is protected. Yet certain regulations govern who can and cannot vote. These regulations are in place to ensure the integrity of the electoral process. Understanding these restrictions is crucial for residents of Squealkill to participate effectively in their civic duty. Firstly, age is a primary criterion. Individuals must be at least 18 years old on or before the day of the election to be eligible to vote. This requirement aligns with federal voting laws and is consistent across the United States. Citizenship is another critical factor. Only U.S. citizens are permitted to vote in federal, state, and most local elections. This excludes non-citizen residents, regardless of their contribution to the community or length of residence in Squealkill. Residency requirements also play a significant role. Voters must be residents of Pennsylvania and their electoral district in Squealkill for at least 30 days before the election. This ensures that voters have a stake in the local decisions made through the electoral process. Furthermore, individuals convicted of felonies may face restrictions. In Pennsylvania, felons who are incarcerated on the date of an election cannot vote. However, those who have been released or are on probation or parole regain their voting rights. This reflects a balance between upholding the law and providing a path to civic reintegration. Lastly, individuals declared mentally incompetent by a court are also ineligible to vote. This criterion is sensitive and subject to legal scrutiny to protect the rights of all individuals while ensuring the electoral process's integrity. Understanding these restrictions is essential for the residents of Squealkill to ensure they are eligible to vote and to encourage participation in the democratic process. It is a shared responsibility to uphold the principles of democracy by participating in elections within the framework of these regulations. To learn more, check out these links, which you can click in the description below and feel free to comment your questions. We're here to help. Thanks for tuning in to our video. Please like and subscribe and leave a comment below. See you in the next video.